So over here, you can see that I have a frame and if I want to enable out a layout grid so that I can uh, align this out in a layout, then you can click on frame and over here in layout grid, you can simply press the plus button. And here you can show and hide the layout grid right here. So you can go around and then select out these options right here so that you can align them in grid now to make it easier for you to work. But if you want to hide out this layout grid, you can go around over here and then hide this out from here. But if you have multiple grids, let's say for example, you get another grid right here. So you get like a column grid right here, a layout grid, and you want to hide all of the grid all together. Then you can go around over here onto the file menu you can go around into view and then here you can see layout grid is turned on. Simply click on this and then it is hidden. So over here you can see that these are seen right here. These are in scene mode. You can click here again to enable it out. Alternatively, you can go around over here, disable this or you can go around over here onto view and enable this out right here. So this is what you have. Apart from the layout grid, you can also enable and disable pixel grid. So you do not really see out pixel grid when you're working in this view. But if I were to zoom in right here, very, very far, you can see that individual pixel is represented right here. And this is how everything is there. Even if the graphics right here is vector, when we export it, it is exported out in these indiv individual pixel format right here. And that is why you see this. But if you do not want to see the individual pixel grid right here, you can go around over here, go to view, and you can disable the pixel grid over here as well. And you do not see this uh, just like this. You can go around over here and go to view, click on pixel grid, and then this is enabled out again. And that is how you can enable and disable the pixel grid and layout grid inside of a Figma design file. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.